Hello, I'm Walt Richardson. Join me for a special night of original music from some of Arizona's best live performers. That's coming up on Songwriters Showcase. Good evening, and thank you for joining me for this Songwriters Showcase. Our first performers are a husband and wife team from Scottsdale. Tom Bertling is a full-time musician known as Smoot Mahooty. His wife Priscilla joins him to sing harmonies. I think you'll really enjoy the unique sound that borrows from many musical styles. It's a combination they describe as mutt music. Well, my background uh, starts when I was about seven years old. This music is all I do. It's, I started playing out in 1978. The music has been the constant through pretty much my whole life. Hey Priscilla, please don't be mad to me. Hey Priscilla. I want the audience to feel the emotion in the songs and to be able to connect with that. I've always, uh, whenever I write a song, uh, especially about my family, uh, my goal is to try to reach in and touch somebody in their heart. What makes the, the songs unique when we perform them together is the feeling that we put into it. You know, we leave it all on the stage. Life is pain. Pain is love. Love is strange. When it comes to push and shove. When it comes to push and shove. When we are singing together and there's there's this energy that passes between the two of us that's so filling and we it's just a it's just a wonderful um, experience and it's really gratifying to be able to sing with him and, and I'm honored to always be able to sing with my husband. You know I love What I hope uh, the audience comes away with is the, how genuine the music is and how genuine uh, our feeling for each other is. 
and that we truly enjoy doing what we're doing and could not think of doing anything else and truly are honored to play for all the people that we play for and play the music uh, for all the people that are listening. Thinking about the time when I first heard the music play From the hands of my grandma she passed it on my way Singing songs from a time when she was young and the living wasn't easy It's never easy I used to think that apple dumplings grew in grandma's stove She'd make them just for me, smile and tell me to eat real slow Her pumpkin blossom specially prepared with loving care, how we please me still went down easy grandma made me memories and grandma sang me songs taught me about things you can't put prices on not loving the stars or trees or gentle breezes after rain or the frost upon my Writing songs can happen so many different ways, and there are different sides to songwriting. There's a, there's a feel side, and there's a craft side to songwriting. Uh, sometimes I'll get an idea, uh, a lyric idea, and that will be the start of the song. Or sometimes I'll pick up the guitar, and I'll play a couple of chords, and then that leads to a melody. And then when I have the melody, I try to think of what will fit you know, what lyric will fit with the melody. Grandma had four husbands, outlived them all but one. The last one asked me, was there anything of hers I'd want? Well, I told him the only thing I ever wanted, she already gave. know it saved me. Grandma gave me memories and Grandma sang me songs. Taught me about things you can't put prices on. Not loving the stars or trees or gentle breezes after rain or the frost upon my windowpane. You can't put him in a specific category, that's the beauty of it and that's what I've always enjoyed because it's so much fun to mix it up and uh, yeah it is it is definitely mutt music a little bit of this and a little bit of that hey thanks Kate Brennan grew up on the road traveling cross-country absorbing a diversity of musical influences in addition to writing music Kate writes for magazines websites and even a feature film released in 2012 her lyrical tales and musical style a equal parts joyful guitar hooks and 70s style piano rock. A faded smile, another trial for you. You're reaching for another show, but you cannot be true. Most of my time and energy in any given day is either writing, thinking about writing songs, or you know, trying to sort of bring them to life. I think, as a songwriter, I think that I have songs that other artists might be interested in, in covering. And I think that, as a performer, I think there's an audience for me. I, I think there's an audience for these songs. I think I have something to offer that's, you know, it's whatever, whatever for better or for worse, it's, it's unique.
I grew up with my great grandmother and she uh, had been a musician in the 30s and 40s and and so I, I kind of caught the love of music from her and she had a great record collection with lots of jazz and vocals, the Mills Brothers and Louis Armstrong and the Ink Spots and all of that kind of music and so that all was, was sort of part of my DNA uh, as well. I like the freedom that I have to, to be all of those things and, and to bring all of that, those different, you know, oddball areas of history in my life uh, to bear on, on what I write, what I, what I sing. But then you It's a rough instrument, <laughs> my voice, but I give my heart and soul in it. You know, I, I put a lot of feeling into what my voice does, and and hopefully that resonates. You call my name. I have a song called Dear Arthur, uh, which I, I kind of just was coming out of nowhere. I got the melody and I got a little bit of the words. And I didn't know who this character Arthur was that I was writing about, but I was writing, you know, I was writing a song and telling a little story. And I, I got to the end of the song and I just, I actually started to cry a little bit. I suddenly realized that I had written the story of my father at, at the end of his life. Dear Arthur, no, I don't mean to be a bother, but every day has been like a slaughter since your departure. Dear Arthur. said she ran like water to other men who sold and bought her when you forgot She picked your bones just like a vulture And yet you loved her
I'm very excited to take the song for the people and I, I really want to communicate and I want them to feel what I feel. I want them to sort of come into this world that I've created in these songs, these stories and, and I want to share that and sort of make the connection, you know, person to person, heart to heart, you know, me to those people and, and vice versa. And I'm really, you know, really looking forward to, to that and, you know, I hope people will connect with us. Ivan Harshman is a full-time musician based in Phoenix. You can find him performing original music and covers in a variety of venues, small and large. He's just as comfortable singing in an intimate coffee house as he is opening for such acts as David Crosby, Roger Klein and the Peacemakers, or the Zombies. Wherever you catch his act, you will certainly love his music. I, I love music. When I was a kid, I had a huge stack of 45s. I'd lock myself in the room, and I had a little record player that was my own, one of those old suitcase record players, and I'd just sit there and listen to Motown and, and just old Beatles cuts, and just, I loved it. And that's, you know, I've always loved music, always. She said, cuss a guy, what he deserved, and you will get what you deserve. I can't believe she had the nerve to say those things to me. Oh, but lately I'm a victim of my own admission. I went on drinking without permission, and she made me sleep on the couch for what seemed like half a year. Oh, a man of these have changed my life, but not as much as my ex-wife. I caught her with a fishing knife when she thought I was asleep. And it was 13 years of other blues, dodging ashtrays and bowling shoes. She'd do anything. She could find. She should have hit for the Detroit Tigers instead of hitting on a minor like me. Like me, yeah, oh baby, so don't tell our friends are such, but I still love you way too much. Even though you broke my records, baby, and the rules. Pop, there's no alarm. I've got your name tattooed on my arm, and it says forever, short time and Julia. A big inspiration for me when I was coming up was my uncle Mike. He was a player and uh, a singer, and uh, I, just, I just spent a lot of time with him as, as, as a young boy, and, and I really look up to him. She shoot a pitch for the Detroit Tigers, instead of throwing on a mind. My style of music, it's, it's all over the map because I like different styles of music. Uh, when, I, when, I, when I'm writing songs on acoustic guitar, they're acoustic guitar songs, you know? They have that singer-songwriter quality to them. Um, when I play in a band, I want to rock out. I mean, I want to write songs for a band, I want them to rock. Well, it was 14 years of other blues, a dodge and ashtrays, a bowling show, she fell in a thing. Did he hit for the Detroit Tigers? Stay 
already hitting on a man Even though you broke my records, baby And the rules And the weary part was no alarm I got some them tattooed on my dog And it says forever, short time And Julie And it says forever, short time And Jules Oh, and it says forever, short time And Julie I love playing live. I love seeing people there. I, I, for me, to record, you'd have to have a big recording studio with 50 people sitting there looking at me while I do it. Then I would, then I would enjoy it. Uh, just because I, I feel like then that's when it's going to come out the best. Left the door open, but I was too busy playing. Mama called me, but I didn't come home. It feels like you're working on a mystery novel With misdirection and warm suspense We used to hold hands, now we're holding on to yesterday Despite all the hardships, and we are still friends I wish I could turn these tears into gasoline we could take to the highway just to see where it ends yeah yeah Ooh. honey what's wrong with me Ooh. i don't know do i want to be famous Maybe, I don't, not too much. Would I, I'd rather have the money, I've always said that. I'd rather sell songs and have the money and, and, and then be famous. I need to catch a breeze. Sweep clean this playing board. The sailor's a game, but it's so much more. And there's always a loser, but sometimes a winner. I can't tell which one you're rooting for You said I'm a broken man With too many moving parts And all of the hard work has made you tired But I've been around this world and I I've never met a single soul Without some assembly required we used to hold hands, now we're holding on to yesterday Despite all the hardships, we are still friends I wish I could turn these tears into gasoline We could take to the highway just to see where it ends Yeah, yeah Honey, what's wrong with me? Ooh, I don't know. Mama, what's wrong with me? Ooh, so I'll take one on the chin. I'm not bothered with saving face. I got a lot of scars from my own mistakes But I don't want to scar nobody else With my darkened ways So I'm willing to do whatever it takes Used to hold hands, now we're Holding on for life Despite all the hardships, we can still grow Doing my best to turn all these wrongs into rights. So open your door, cause I'm coming home. 
I just want them to remember me and go, I want to go see this guy. I want to see what else he has. I want to, I want to hear the rest of his material. I, I, I want them to go, oh, hey, there's still guys that can actually sing and that can actually play and that do it for a living and it's not just a part of yesteryear and, and it's, it's not dead completely. I want them to remember that, that there's still guys out there like me that like to perform and can perform and that rock and roll isn't really dead yet. Thank you for joining me for this Songwriter Showcase series. For information about the Walk-In Wednesday Open Mic Series, the Songwriter Showcase, and any of our wonderful events happening at the Tempe Center for the Arts, be sure to check out our website at tempe.gov forward slash TCA. I'm Walt Richardson. Until we meet again, keep jamming, keep practicing, keep singing.